Hi guys, this is Frenchy and today I want to make a video that is actually a bit tinier than what I'm usually doing because I've done a lot of big videos recently and I just want to have a very chill video with you guys just like we sit, we do a tutorial, it's fun, you know. So because I'm very talented, I forgot the SGD uh, that I was supposed to take to my parents to make the tutorial of the day for night that I've done for Riot Games. So this video is going to be a bit delayed, I'm sorry for that. What I wanted to do is actually just making a video to keep in touch with you guys because I really appreciate to be on YouTube and it's great to be here. I just wanted to show you like what I use now as a technique for Promise because I find that it's working pretty well and you can customize it the way you want. In this tutorial, we are not using Glow. I am using another method where uh, you have more control over your image while you are doing your promise. So let's jump right in guys! So here we are in our timeline. Uh, I don't change camera because my webcam is just showing the mess that I have around me. Uh, because you know, like when you come back to your parents, all your old habits are coming back with it. So I have my old habits as a teenager that was just like putting clothes everywhere and all that. So I spare you the struggle of uh, seeing this video with a ton of clothes behind me. I've done a really quick grade just like for us to do the promise. For this, I've just done two nodes actually. I've put my lot uh, called Budapest uh, that you can find in the Colorist Companion pack uh, that I've put online. I will put the link in the description. Uh, so yes, this lot is putting the image uh, pretty well actually. Like the, I really like the skin tones in it and it's making everything quite clean. And for the balance, I just uh, raise everything with the offset. Uh, so now that we have this, uh, let's look at what we are going to achieve in this tutorial is that we want to achieve this kind of look, which is something very glowy and having this kind of effects going on that is this dreamy effect uh, on our image. So. To do this, let's just do our node. So our node for promise is going to be after our uh, lot. Why I wanted after my creative lot? It's because it's an effect and most of the time we will prefer to have effects at the last part of our node tree. So when you created your node after your creative lot or your look, what you're going to do is going to your blur radius and in radius you're gonna go really on top something like this or maybe if you want to have a bit more uh, softness going on in the highlights you can go a bit upper and have something really blurry after you've done this with your blur radius uh, you can go to your node go to composite mode and go to screen when I screen this, not all the image is taken in consideration for my blur, but only the light that is going on in the image. And this is what we want because the promise is making the highlights softer. So maybe what we have is very bright and pretty crazy. What we can do is in the same node, going to our curves and I'm going to go to my curves, custom curves, and uh, I'm going to put my editable spline. So if you don't have it check, please check it. And uh, I'm going to select this point over here at the bottom of my chart. And I'm going to take my point and just go down. So I have a more natural contrast going on in my image. What we have right now is this was before and this is after. So it's pretty good. I, I really like it actually. Uh, what I can do is just have a bit more contrast and here you go. So this is before, this is after. In this image, then now we have a very strong bloom going on. It will create this promised effect. Okay, that's all for me, guys. I really hope you liked the video. 
and um, I really miss uh, posting on YouTube <laughs> actually uh, so I really wanted to do something you know um, and something that is useful so I hope you liked it and I see you next time guys that was a pleasure to come back to YouTube and do a video like that see you next time <laughs>